Justin Trudeau is under intense scrutiny, with mounting calls for his resignation and whispers of potential defections among lawmakers. Follow up. Um, are there there are members of your caucus that are considering leaving if you do stay on? What's your reaction to that? And are you, are you willing to stay on and lose members of your caucus? I think the conversations that I'm having with uh, MPs directly right across the country, the conversations that we're all having as liberals uh, are going to continue and we're going to stay focused on Canadians. I can't speak to uh, to uh, what people in the media are thinking. That's your job. But I can speak to the uh, strength and focus that all Liberals have on delivering for Canadians, and that's what we're going to continue to do. The heart of leadership. Trudeau's reluctance to address these pressing questions directly is seen by many as an evasion of responsibility, a sidestepping of the transparency and accountability expected of a leader. True leadership means facing challenges head-on, openly acknowledging and addressing internal party conflicts without shying away from them. The public's focus on Trudeau's dedication to Canadians often feels like a diversion from the real issues plaguing his party, a strategic move to sidestep internal dissent and dissatisfaction. Conservatives argue that resolving these internal conflicts is crucial for unified and effective governance, ultimately benefiting the populace. Trust in leadership is the bedrock of effective governance. The erosion of this trust in Trudeau signals his diminishing ability to govern effectively, indicating a loss of confidence among his party members. If a leader loses the trust of his own party, it's a clear sign that new leadership is needed to restore stability and deliver meaningful results for the people. 